do you think we should start looking at the first family of football differently? Look, uh, you know I'm a big Eli Manning fan and a Giants fan, and the facts have not fully come out here. And some, a person's reputation um, is difficult to repair once it's been damaged if people speak recklessly about them. So I think the facts, you know, should come out before people draw conclusions about what's happening. That said, the fact that it is even being reported, it's, look, it's no crime that the Manning family likes money. They come from some money, their father played, uh, and, um, and they like to make it. I mean, you can't turn on the TV in the last 10, 15 years without one of the Manning brothers selling you something. Pizza, cars, insurance, whatever it is, they're selling you something all the time. And that's fine, nothing wrong with that. What, what the problem is here for Eli is that um, there's a sense that, that there's a racket going on. That, you know, what's being reported is that there, he's making money and not delivering the goods or somehow potentially the, the charge, I guess, would be defrauding people. And, and because he makes so much money playing football and with legitimate advertising, et cetera, at a certain point, people are going to say, wait a minute, why do you need, why is there even a whiff of a racket around this guy? And I understand that sensibility. And in fact, there, it's not just stuff that happens that would be illegal were it happening. But several years ago, St. Vincent's Hospital, that was uh, being financially run terribly, apparently, and St. Vincent's Hospital is right in my neighborhood, uh, downtown New York, right across the street from where I went to elementary school, PS41. I was in that emergency room, you know, before. Like, I, St. Vincent's Hospital is an institution in the neighborhood. But, and, and it's not that Eli Manning was the reason that they had to close down, but he was receiving payments to essentially promote the hospital. He wasn't doing it for free. He was, he was getting paid a good amount of money. And in the, uh, ultimately, he, he said he'd forego the last half million dollars they owed him because they were in debt, like $700 million, some crazy number, and, and eventually had to close down. And there was criticism at the time, well, it's nice that you're giving up a half million dollars, but that's a lot of money. How much money have you already gotten from this hospital when you've essentially been advertising, when you have been advertising for them? And why are you taking money from a hospital even if it's a million dollars or whatever it is, and that's a lot of money when you're making, when you have a contract for a hundred million dollars. You know, it, so, it, so it does add, w without trying to uh, smear someone and, and without attacking their reputation before the facts come out, it does add to an overall sense in the Manning family that, um, that they're very interested in, in earning a lot of money um, and, and this is not a good look.